Hey everybody! It is Go. And John with Let's Open It. And today we are back with a subscri my subscription addiction from Loot Crate, the remix yes. of November. Remix November. So what the remix kits are is like their past products that they have overflow and they just throw in a box for real cheap, like 15 bucks a month. And uh, you get some cool stuff. You get cool stuff. I've... I've liked it so far. It's mm -hmm. kind of a nice little thing. Uh, I think that last uh, October crate was pretty cool. Yeah. Um, plus, guys, if you're always looking for gifts for, like, your kids or mm -hmm. uh, just gifts to give to special, your nerdy friends, yeah, like, you can just life. basically re-gift the stuff that's in the box. You yeah. Know, kind or of just a, get them a subscription to Loot Crate. That, too. So, Loot Crate, please give us free stuff because we are highly speaking of your things yeah i mean i was a loot crate subscriber for a while and then i got poor so i had to stop yes but this one's affordable 15 bucks a month yes and uh you know what loot crate we want the uh marvel one. Oh my gosh that's the one we want we, we keep checking the door because somebody is supposed to join us and they have not yet yes i wonder who that could be or it could be loot crate it's like here's it your could, it could be yes. and a reverse yeah loot crate is just going to show up at the door and say <laughs> hello boys <laughs> Mr. Loot Crate here. So, this is November's. Please like, comment, subscribe. Please, please, we invite you to hit the subscribe button. Yes. Right now, we're going to take time. Subscribe. And like the button. Do all the good things. And we want to thank Matt Rush and the Kingdom Crush Games for being founder level Patreon supporters. Yes. Woo. <laughs> you too can actually go to our Patreon and, and support us there for as little as a dollar a month. Because until... Uh, Loot Crate starts giving us uh, the free crates. We, we buy this every month. We do buy this every month. So we will see what's in this box. <laughs> Oh man, there's some fog coming off of that. We have a fog that, machine. That Loot Crate. We got a fog machine. His name is John. <coughs> Novembers. All right. Do it. Flip it. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Oh, is that a and d thing? Yes, a castle dice tower. Oh, that is oh. sick. I don't know if it's as cool as the Bron Bespoke dice towers. Yes. Bron Bespoke, company owned by myself and Brexton, who's invisible. Yep. Uh, we make Oh, them. it comes with a D20. Mm-hmm. Oh, my God. That is sick. This is a little tiny one. It's an ashtray. Yeah. <laughs> It'll look good next to my... Uh, uh, yeah, the dragon? Oh, dragon. Pull it out of that plastic. It's a terrain piece, too. Kind of. Yeah. That's kind really, of... It's really small to be a terrain piece, but... Yeah. So, here. Yeah, well. Try it out. Perfect. Yep. It worked. And it rolled a nat one. Nat one. Uh, not, not a very good dice, I guess. That's... That's, 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 about, my luck. that's about the luck we get. Yep. Mm -hmm, yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's really sick. If you ever play with me, uh, I John will tear. I am I am very bad at rolling dice. Are those? Uh, oh, are these Game of Thrones songs? Shh. We don't know yet. It's not on camera. Well, uh, they're Harry Potter socks. Oh, Harry Potter. I saw the line and I was like Lannisters, you know. So this was gonna go to one of our patrons. Um, that's pretty dope. Harry Potter socks. Harry Potter socks. Oh, it's got the sorting hat on top. Yeah. That just gives us Jason. <laughs> he doesn't watch Harry Potter. <laughs> He's never seen a Harry Potter movie. Be a good gag gift. Oh, these are kind of really cool. The Luke Gaming collectible pin. Oh, nifty. Those are, that's kind of cool. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. Maybe if we'll focus. Who cares? Focusing. And Alita Battle Angel. Uh, I saw that movie and I really enjoyed it. It was actually a pretty decent movie. I uh, think the ending was a little wonky. And they were like, set up for the sequel. Which they won't because they didn't make enough money. But overall, it's pretty good. Yeah, it's kind of cool. And if you're a fan of the manga, then I'm sure you also enjoyed it, hopefully. Yeah. So and they did the super intense roller derby at the end. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. They kind of build it like that was what the movie was going to be about. Yeah. Do I don't know if the movie. Of, they didn't do a whole lot of roller derbying. I don't know if the movie knew what it wanted to be. Nope. It was one of those like, hey, let's put a lot of like cyborg looking cool things in there. And, and then, they also were like produced by James Cameron. So everybody's like, oh man, is this directed by James Cameron? And no. They were like produced by produced. James Cameron. So that's November's Loot Crate Remix, which is actually a pretty good deal. I thought it was cool. The D and D thing was nice. Yeah, that is really nice. That dice tower is pretty cool. Uh, Again, is it as cool as the Bron Bespoke dice towers? I don't know. Do you have one here? Yeah. Go grab one of those. In the meantime, was it worth it? 
Was it worth it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, I think the fifteen dollar dice tower alone is. Yeah, I mean it's a mini dice tower, but I mean if you're if you need a dice tower and you want to show it off, it's pretty neat. Yeah. But it's not as cool as the Brom Bespoke dice towers that we make here at Brom Bespoke. Uh, this is a Kingdom exclusive, has the Kingdom cards and games. It is a foldable backpack dice tower. So yeah, no, just, that is, it is perfect to take with you on the go to your session, wherever it is. When we play D&D, &D, we house. use this all the time. Uh, we, yeah. I, we all have them. Like, uh, yeah, it's also a cool phone holder, all that good stuff. And it's customizable because you can have whatever you want engraved there. Yes. go to. I'll put our website in the description below so you can see where you can get these. At. And then we can do custom engraving or whatever that you like. So a little shout out to Brom Bespoke. Or you can, you can get a Kingdom one if you like the Kingdom one. Or you one, go to the Kingdom one, yeah. Come here to Kokomo, Indiana. How much are these for you guys? Uh, 25 bucks. 25 bucks. Awesome. Good deal. And please like, comment, subscribe, do all those good things, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.